In this episode of Rob Christie Hike Across America, we head to Santa Fe, New Mexico to check out some pretty wild sculptures. We're going to walk around some Indian ruins down at Pecos Historical Site. But first, we drive all the way to the top of Capulin Volcano National Monument. But we're not stopping there. We're climbing all the way down inside. Now, the Capulin Volcano is located just off the Interstate 87 in Capulin, New Mexico. So we're here at our first stop in New Mexico, which is the Capulin Volcano National Monument. Still hanging out with James, traveling trekkies. Oh yeah. oh yeah. Now, Capulin Volcano runs $25 per car, or free if you have the American the Beautiful Pass. Now, this place reminded me a lot of Scott's Bluff National Monument down in Nebraska, where you get to drive to the top of the monument and hike around. So we just arrived to the top of the Capulin Volcano. Gonna look down in the crater right now. Yeah, you, there's a trail, you can go down there, James. Yep, right here. Wow. Trail wow. goes on down. Yeah, they're, they're coming up. You can go all the way down to the, the volcano, man, if you want. All right, let's do yeah, it. let's do it. And just like that, me and the Trekkies head on down into the mouth of a volcano. Right now I'm heading down this trail that leads down into the volcano. There's a little platform down there. They also have another trail that goes around the entire rim of the volcano. I don't think we're gonna have time to do that, but we're definitely going down inside. Volcanic rock coming out of the ground. We're all down this side of this hill. It's pretty neat so far. Cool little stop. The drive going up is really cool. Windy road goes all the way around the volcano, comes up the top, and then you get a walk on down. And then up there is the rim trail. You can actually walk all the way around the rim. In a complete circle. Check out that lava there. Absolutely awesome. Very neat little place. Now they do have a lava flow trail here down at the bottom of the volcano, which we didn't do. However, we do do the one at Sunset Crater a couple days later. But after doing that one, I regret not doing the one here. I also regret not doing the rim trail here as well. Well, we'll head on out to our, our next stop. It's probably about an hour and a half away, maybe. Yeah. That's cool. Isn't that cool? Now, Pecos Historical Park is located just a few miles off of Interstate 25 in Pecos, New Mexico. We're at the Pecos Indian Ruins here in New Mexico. It's our second stop of the day. Ooh, there's a flag anywhere. <laughs> now Pecos is wheelchair accessible and there are two options you can take here. There is a trail that starts behind the visitor center which is a little bit longer or you can drive up to the second parking lot which is more easily accessible to the ruins. Now for thousands of years, this area was inhabited by the indigenous Pueblo Indians. That is until 1600 when the Spanish came in, colonized the area, and took rule over the people. But in 1680, the Pueblo people band together 
and overthrew the Spanish government, making it the first American revolt in history. Spanish church that the Native Americans destroyed. Down inside one of the underground Pueblo rooms here. It's actually pretty cool. Next stop just happened to be Ethel the Well in Santa Fe, New Mexico, which is located about four miles south of Interstate 25. So we didn't make it to our time schedule on Petroglyphs National Monument. We're gonna wind up being late, so we're adding this well sculpture and a couple other ones back into the set list. So it turns out during the off season, National Monuments close at 4.30 in the afternoon, which actually led to us missing quite a few stops due to time restraints. Now, Ethel is an 82 foot long, life size replica of a whale made completely out of recycled plastic and is in the Guinness Book of World's Record for largest sculpture made completely out of recycled trash. else here in a few minutes. Now our next stop took us to Meow Wolf, which is about four miles north of Interstate 25 in Santa Fe, New Mexico. So we're at our next stop here in New Mexico. This is an old bowling lane called Meow Wolf, which is kind of an art center. They have a giant uh, robot here and spiders and some other cool artwork. to the giant spider and the giant wolf. Yeah, we'll... 
In the next episode of Rob Christie Hike Across America, we go to the Navajo Code Tucker Memorial down in Window Rock, Arizona. Then we go to the windiest place I've ever been in my life, inside of a meteor crater. And then we end up in one of the biggest disappointments of the entire trip, down at Grand Falls. So if you found yourself liking this video and you want to see more, please like, share, subscribe. There's plenty on the channel, more on the way. Until next time, keep on hiking.